Hey guys, so I'm trying to get somebody at a higher level besides God. Um, not beyond God. There's no such thing. To appreciate my perspective and my resolution to what is called the Odyssey. And a lot of you might not know what that word means, but I want to read to you some things. This is the Odyssey defined, okay? God is good, all-knowing, and all-powerful. Okay, great. <laughs> Sorry. You'll understand in a second. The universe was made by God. Okay, yeah. yeah. You got anything? There is evil in the world for unknown reasons. Okay? I'm going to back up, and I'm going to give you the definition of the Odyssey. The vindication of divine goodness and providence in the view of the existence of evil. The question of the Odyssey. And what I'm trying to tell you is, I can take that book, that most purchased and least read book, and use it to give you a theodicy that not only explains and justifies the existence of evil, but actually proves that it's necessary as per the way God operates. If you can help me in this, it would be greatly appreciated. I'm very frustrated. I'm not a dummy. I can't really read because when I look at a few words, they just connect and go in 50 different directions. Um, but I'm, I can think. And uh, <laughs> help me. Because otherwise, I'm going to give up. I, I just can't. I can't deal with this stupidness out there. It's pathetic. It's pathetic and it's disgusting. And it does nothing to honor the God that I serve. And I'm going to use scripture, iron, to break clay. Bring it. Shalom.